So let's just go with it. Let's just pretend. Let's put on the, the hat. That, okay, we're going to pretend that it's true that uh, you are in love with someone who you can't have. If I'm actually in love with someone that I can't have, what other things need to be true in the universe? Faulty thinking. Things that are really are not true. And when looking at these things and realizing that in order for you to be in love with someone you can't have, which is faulty thinking, it's actually a defense mechanism, it's a way to keep love away. When you look at the other things that would have to be true that are clearly not true, and then you look at the things that are true, it helps to put it into a healthy perspective that can help you heal and allow yourself to expand your willingness and your ability to love yourself and others. So, faulty truths would have to be the universe is a very limited place. The universe has very limited options available and or these are all and or okay in no particular order other than the order that my inner being is flowing them out to me while I record myself while I'm walking the universe would have to be a very limited place with very limited options you yourself would have to be a very limited being with very limited options love itself as an energy